Hi guys. It's just me and Grace. Isn't that right, Grace? Let's see, pretty Grace. This is her evening routine. She finds me and she cuddles up and gets warm and goes to sleep. Don't you, Grace? Yeah, she's purring and she's leaning forward. I'm like, <laughs> You are so funny. <laughs> she just trusts that I'm not going to drop her. She just flops any way she wants to. Don't you? Mm, don't you? Spoiled cat. Mm. This is Grace. Snuggling down. <laughs> she usually drapes that paw, a paw across the front of me. It's like a cat hug. Sweet. Anyway, Grace and I are just hanging out, doing nothing. Becky is off work, but she's out roaming around with her boyfriend, and Uncle Cece and I are just hanging out. I called him today, and or he called me to let me know he uh, was on his way home, which he does every day. And I said, if you're hungry, you better bring something home. I don't have anything cooked. <clears throat> I've had like I may have had eight hours in three days really I may have uh, I am going to crash tonight because I can feel it I am tired so excuse me I didn't have the energy to do it I'm just blah which I should be uh, I feel like she looks sleepy and like going comatose. Hey, see my new scissors? These are Fiskars Soft Touch. I've just about gotten to the age in the bad eye level that I can barely read some things and they have to be further out. I remember I used to could read right up here. I can't do that anymore. It has to be further out. So I need to get my eyes rechecked. And uh, Uncle Cece started a job not too terribly long ago. But I don't think our insurance cards have come in yet. I'm not sure. So, um, we've got to get eyes checked. i got to get a new prescription. And I should be wearing mine all the time because when I don't wear them, I get headaches. And I hardly ever wear the darn things. And I'm so used to headaches. Like, I got really used to them when I had the... Bef before I had the brain tumor taken out, um, I had to take something three, four times a day for headaches. So after you get certain, t you know, used to a certain pain level and something, you can kind of stick it back until it's really banging. So, uh, but I, I do that, and I shouldn't do that. And my eyes are suffering. So, yeah, I need to go get my prescription changed. And I have a separate medical issue that my body um, makes too much spinal fluid. Have you ever heard of that? Apparently it only happens to um, overweight women and young boys. That's weird, isn't it? Or the majority of it happens to that certain demographic. And, yeah. and that causes pressure to be placed on my eyes and it can eventually make you go blind so I have to get the fluid drained off ever so often um, but I haven't had a problem with it here lately so I'm wondering if it's settling down some I don't know but um, yeah eye things yeah, it can make you go blind but um, so they say losing weight will help it. Yeah. So, <laughs> we'll see. But, um, not much going on. I don't even know where I left off. I, I get on this thread and, and I take it all the way to the end and then I can't remember where I started to wrap it up. So, anyway. Um, 
I'm going to work on some projects this evening. I've got so many. Um, if you've seen my craft video, you'll see that I did uh, my mother-in-law. It's a little plaque. Hers is fairly plain. You can go really elaborate on them. But um, you can hang it with a hanger, hang rip, you know, make holes and put ribbons in and stuff and <coughs> make a wall plaque out of it. Or you can do like, you know, me, like I did for hers, and I just put magnets, strong magnets, on the back of it, hot glued them to the back of it, and she can stick it on the side of her refrigerator because she doesn't really hang a lot of things on, on the wall in the kitchen. Um, she has a big painting in the dining room, but as far as in the kitchen, you know, it just gets too much muck and dust and stuff, so she doesn't really do that. But she does use a refrigerator, and um, the way her new cabinets are, she had her, just had her kitchen remodeled. The way her new cabinets are now, you can see a nice framed space at the side of the refrigerator uh, next to her cabinet. So I thought that would make a good spot for it. So I put magnets on it, and it sticks to the fridge. So, um, but I've got, I'm doing one for each, all four of the girls, um, my nieces, um, on my side of the family, uh, for their bedrooms, I'm doing them one with names, and it's got tool, and, the, or it'll have tool, and pretty flowers, and be girly, um, for their rooms, so I want to finish those up so that I can carry them with me. And of course, I'm painting the buckets and I'm painting the glasses. And uh, I've got to do also one of those magnetic boards for my mother, stepmother's um, Mother's Day, um, which I'll take to her in June when we go on our trip. So I've got a lot of projects to finish before then, and I've got other, you know, cooking for the trip and packing for the trip and moving furniture yeah I've been over this all before so lots of junk to do and sometimes it just feels overwhelming and you think uh, so we'll see but um, let me see I'm trying to think so anyway I'm gonna work on some projects like that this evening and getting organized and tomorrow's Friday my sister will be off and um, she's promised me that she'll clean her room. <laughs> the main thing is I need, she kind of uses the spare bed as a extra closet space and I, and you know, I need her to pick some of that stuff up and hang it up because I need that bed to, um, and she's got hanging up places. It's just, you know, lay it across the bed kind of deal. So I need that space to organize for the trip. I'm making my lists and I'm checking them twice and anything that's not perishable, I just get, I go to Sam's and get, you know, like great boxes or something, leave them outside for a few days to make sure there's no strange bugs, you know, that I'm gonna bring into the house. And then I uh, put them up there and every time I get something for my list for a trip, I put it in the box and go. So I, I need to do that. It's time to do that. It's past time. I usually do that a month ahead. So yeah, I got to do that. I'm going um, to get some things this weekend and I just need to add here and there. So yeah. So tomorrow she's going to do that and we've got to do some running around errands and picking up some groceries for the next week and so stuff no fun scrapbooking stuff. I love that because I'm giving up my allowance. Uncle Cece and I both get an allowance and I'm giving mine up for gas. Yeah. Stinks. Alright you guys, I gotta go. I shouldn't even make this in the first place, but I'm making it and I'm gonna post it. See you guys later. Bye.